Patients uh, always want to know why did I get sick? You know, what was that one event that uh, pushed me into having this horrible condition? And uh, what I like to say to people is that it's not one event. Now, I know of CRPS that we've been taught, and if you look online, most often that it is caused by trauma. And it is true that there is usually one single event that the patient would feel okay before, and they're fine, and then uh, they fracture a leg, or they have an ingrown toenail, or slam their fingers in the car door, and then they develop CRPS. Uh, for Ehlers-Danlos Syndrome, the same thing. People think, well, you know, I have this genetic predisposition, but I want to know why all of a sudden when I was 14, I became symptomatic. So the, the answer to that is both simple and also complicated. And I like to refer to it as the perfect storm. So uh, let's start with conditions like complex regional pain syndrome. Um, people have stress. We all have stress in our lives. But if you suffer from Ehlers-Danlos Syndrome, complex regional pain syndrome, or POTS, you have a specific genetic blueprint that maybe predisposes you to suffer from these syndromes um, and have these symptoms. But physical, chemical, and emotional stress will pile up and pile up till eventually you reach that you reach peak mass, and there's this what I call an imaginary line. And if you go through that line, all of a sudden you're in crisis mode. So it's not that you were okay before you were symptomatic. It's that you didn't know that you were sick. You didn't know that you were in trouble. You didn't know that this massive stress was building up and would reach critical mass and then you would become symptomatic. So it's usually not just one answer and we don't attack it with just one solution. You have to change the patient's diet. You have to support the supplementation, those genetic weaknesses. Uh, you have to look at emotional stress and see how much of that the patient has had. Now it's true that if you build enough of that stress, one thing can happen, let's say it's the Gardasil vaccine that you don't respond well to, or you have the stress building up and then you have one critical injury, it's going to shoot through that line my, uh, much quicker so that it would feel to you that this one thing happened and you got sick but it's usually not just one thing and it's not going to take one solution to get you out of trouble. We have to unravel that perfect storm, calm down all these different elements and make you so strong that you can have daily stress, whether it's physical, chemical or emotional stress and still not be symptomatic.